Do you feel the power? Hey guys, I'm Chikuna and I'm back with another video today. I'm going to be showing you guys a tutorial. Um, I've not done these kind of videos a lot before. I think I've done one or two. But yeah, this one is going to help you guys a lot. So make sure you watch to the end. And the first way is you might be mad saying that it doesn't work. But watch to the end and you'll understand it. So in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a load of FPS without downloading any mods or anything because i know some people don't like downloading mods or texture packs and stuff and still want to get enough fps to play games properly and i'm going to be showing you guys how to do that in this video so first up you need to press f3 if you're on uh, windows and fn f3 if you're on mac or whatever you're, if you have changed your key you can see at the top left corner over here it shows fps and that's how you check fps I'm at 30 FPS right now, that's really bad and that's because I set my settings too bad. And if you have bought a new PC or something like that, your settings will be bad and I can show you guys how to fix it. So you need to press escape, then go to options, then video settings, then you can see your render distance. Bring that down depending on how good your PC is. I like to keep mine on 8, but if yours is bad, you should keep it like 4 or 2. But yeah, I feel 8 is like the good number. And next up. Now you guys can see that our FPS boosted to 60 and it never goes above 60 and if you're asking why um, there are two reasons that might affect this thing you have to go back to video settings again and then if you see this thing use vsync on click it off because if you have kept it on uh, if you bought a new PC then it will be on and then it won't go above 60 FPS so now you guys can see that we have 47 but it will go above 60 uh, it should it will go above 60 but if it's not going then there's one more thing go to your options video settings and then your max frame rate like that's 60 so I like to keep it unlimited so but like okay I lag on hypixel a lot yeah you saw 61 FPS 72 there we go I normally get 150 FPS on Skybounds and other servers, but on Hypixel I get bad FPS because. But when we are in a game, our FPS will be higher, so don't worry, guys. Um, let me just go to our empty lobby so we won't be so laggy. Okay, there's one player in this. And okay, our FPS won't be higher. Yeah, it is higher. You can see that we are at 73. And yeah. So that's one more reason. Um, then video settings, you can like these are the settings for good FPS. Graphics have to be fast, smooth lighting like off. It's better to keep it off. GUI scale is your wish. 3 d angle off, off, clouds off, full screen is your wish. VBOs, I keep it on. I don't really know what it is. Render distance, eight chunks is good if you have a good PC, or else four is four will do the trick. View bobbing, it's your wish, but I keep it off. Depends if you have been using on then it will like lag if you off it But if you have been using off it will not lag if you I mean if you change it if you change it it lags So it's better to keep it off because I like it off brightness if you keep it low it removes the lag But I keep it red because I don't lag that much particles um, if you keep it minimal It's the best and we sync off and alternate blocks on I keep it and the shadows off so these were the settings and how to boost your FPS without Optifine or Isaac or any mods like that. Um, hope you all did enjoy. Um, smash the like button if you did. And comment down below if you want to see more tutorials on which tutorials you want to see. And see you all in the next video. Goodbye guys.